So in this question, we're just going to go and look at how we can calculate potential difference, so the voltage. And uh, primarily, one of the important thing is, a lot of the data that we're going to use is going to go and come from a graph. So a student investigated how the current in circuit varied with the resistance and variable resistance. So figure two shows this. So we go and we've got our graph showing this. So the battery had a power output of 230 mill milliwatts, right? So if it's in milliwatts, don't forget that we're going to have to convert that into watts at some point. So when the resistance of the variable was 36 ohms, determine the potential difference, right? So we're working out what the voltage was. So the first thing that, uh, that I do, apart from work out which equation we're going to use, so remember, go look at the data you've got available to you, use your equation sheet to see which equation you can use. So we're going to use the equation power equals potential difference times by current. So we're going to go and get the current from the graph. So we know that the resistance is 36 ohms, so it's about there. So you'd go up and just read across from your graph to go and get you which what the current is. Right, so we can see there that the current is 0 0.08 amps. Right, next thing that we're going to do, we're going to rearrange this equation to go and give us our potential difference. And we're going to substitute in the numbers. Right, don't forget, because that 230 is in milliwatts, we need to divide that by 1,000 to go and put it into watts. Right, so we're going to go and get our potential difference is equal to 230 divided by 1,000, so 0 0.23. And we're going to divide that by the 0 0.8 that we've just worked out that we've got from the graph. So finally, when we go and work out the answer, it should come to a potential difference or a voltage of 2.875. Right, like I say, don't forget to put the units in, so put the volts in. Right, so that's just how you go and work out that question when we're going in, we're using the graph to go and get some extra data.